20, over 20 months ago, in this very room, the Rebbe spoke and he said, Higia zman geulaschem, which means the time of your redemption has arrived. And the Rebbe further spoke on Pasha Shaftim on Shabbos, and the Rebbe said, that the words that he has told the world from this room many, many times, that the time of our redemption has arrived, the Rebbe said those words as a prophecy, as a nevuah. And we know what the Rambam Maimonides says, that a nevuah, a prophecy, if it is a positive one, a positive prophecy has to be fulfilled. Therefore, we know that the prophecy that the Rebbe has told us is going Hashem to be fulfilled and Moshiach is going to be revealed and he is going to come Emilze Hashem imminently. This, now is the time when we are reading in the Taylor, we are reading the portion of the week concerning our exit of Mitzrayim. I must tell you, since I was a child, I didn't understand one thing. The Taylor tells us, and it's, and it's chronicled in, 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 in Chumash, that the Jews were enslaved in Egypt for 210 years. Then came Meshe Rabbeinu, Moses, and he has told the Jews, I have good news for you. The time of your, exi of your exile has arrived. The time of your redemption has arrived. And one would think that the words that Moses has uttered to the Jewish people was, was accepted with song and with joy. However, we find in Chumash, Veleishamu al Mesha, they did not hear what Mesha said. And the question is, how come that happened? But then we see that after a while, the Jews have started to believe him more and more, and then they all went out of Egypt. Friends, what is happening today is exactly the same thing that happened before we went out of Egypt. Moshe Rabbeinu, the Jewish leader of our generation, is telling us for two years that the time of our, of our redemption has arrived. And although not everyone so far has listened, but there is good news on the horizon. In the parsha of today it says, of Yisrael Yetzim B'Yod Romo, that finally, after a while, everyone listened, and the people of Israel left Egypt B'Yod Romo with an outstretched arm. Therefore we hope that now in Milta Hashem, the words and the message of Meshe Rabbeinu of our time is going to be accepted, and all Jews throughout the world are going to accept it, and all human beings throughout the world are going to accept it, because Moshiach is going to usher in a new world for everyone. It's going to usher in a world without prejudice, without hatred, a world without competition, a world without weapon, a world without war. It will usher in a world of love, of peace, of compassion, of understanding, between man and man, and between nation and nation. And we are gathered here today to, out, to, to outcry to the Almighty that He, and only He, should give the Rebbe the directive that the Rebbe should take us out of Golos, El Eretz, Tevo, El Chovo, to our, into, to our holy land, immediately, speedy, speedily, together with all of us, and let us all say, Amen. What does the Rebbe want from us? The Rebbe, friends, wants from us one thing. The Rebbe says that the time of our redemption has arrived and Moshiach is coming. What does the Rebbe want from us? He wants us to be ready. So when the time Moshiach comes, we should not be embarrassed. We should be ready. We should prepare ourselves spiritually. We should do house cleaning spiritually so we are ready for that greatest moment of all time. I should remind you, friends, this is the same Rebbe, the same Rebbe who told us we shouldn't worry when Saddam Hussein was throwing scuds on Israel. 
This is the same Rebbe who told us just a few weeks ago, we shouldn't worry about the hurricane in Florida, in Hawaii, in Louisiana. This is the same Rebbe to whom hundreds of thousands of people of all religions and of all colors have come for the last 43 years. And they have depended on his word for love in matters of life and death. Now the same Rebbe tells us, I am asking you to remember, says the Rebbe, I am telling you that your, the time of your redemption has arrived. Moshiach is coming and I am begging you, says the Rebbe, to be ready to prepare for that great moment. Therefore, let us, let us heed the Rebbe's call and let us all prepare for that great moment. Velachenu b'nei Yisrael, hanim tsaim b'eretz hakodesh. Velachenu b'nei Yisrael, divrei ha'ivrit, b'chol ha'olam kulo yesh lanu meser. Amru chachamenu zichronam livracha. Ein hakadosh baruchu moes bitfilatam shel rabim, uvifrat alafim urvavot mikol ha'olam kulo. Vanachnu nevakesh hayom. מבורי העולם ומנהיגו שייתן להרבה האות להתגלות במלוא עוזו ותפארתו ויבנה מקדש במקומו ויקבץ נדחי ישראל בקרוב ממש.